Hey guys, so I'm really sorry that I didn't post a video last week, but I have been really ill, like I don't know if you can hear it in my voice, but I've still got a little bit of a cold, so I couldn't upload a video last week as I was pretty much in bed or dragging myself out of bed to see friends and do the things that I needed to do. So today I'm going to do a video that quite a lot of you have requested and that is what's on my iPhone 5S. I recently got a new phone, it's the iPhone 5S and it's gold, but obviously you can't see it because I've got a case on that at the moment which I'll show you in a second I just wanted to say look at my hair I've just been to the hairdressers I was just like I'm not too bothered just take off what you need to because I just want it to be healthy but I can always wear my extensions if I feel like having long hair I will shut up now and I will show you what is on my new phone and I hope you enjoy it so this is my lock screen at the moment and it's a picture of me and my friend Katie. I love that with the 5S it has the fingerprint sensor to open it. So this is my home screen, not very interesting. And this is the case that I have on at the moment. If you watch my other What's On My iPhone video, you'll see that not much has really changed on my home screen, apart from the fact that with the iPhone 5S, there's more space on your home screen to put all your favourite apps on. I've moved my messages down to the bottom, along with my mail, my phone and Safari. I've still got about a million pictures in my camera roll, over 2,000 at the moment, which take up a lot of memory. Instagram is probably the app which I waste most of my time on. If you're not already following me, follow me at Maddie underscore Bruce. I've still got my favourite game Candy Crush on my home screen because I'm still obsessed. I did a bit of reorganising with my utilities folder recently because I decided to be a bit more organised. So I've got like my to-do list and stuff on the first page of that and then the less important ones on the next page. Kick is something which is always going off because I'm always getting really lovely messages from all of you guys and I am really sorry that I don't reply to them all but I do get a lot. Twitter is another one of my favourite apps. If you're not already following me on there, follow me at the Maddie Bruce. Now on to an app which I've become obsessed with lately. It's called Depop. It's where you can sell all your clothes and makeup and whatnot. It's basically like Instagram, but you can click buy and it's amazing. So if you want to download that or if you have it, follow me at the Maddie Bruce. Also on my homepage is MyFitnessPal, Snapchat and eBay. If you want to check out my eBay, my username is Maddie underscore Bruce. To the second page where I have all my folders. So photo editing folder is one of my fave folders which I use quite a lot. Got my Visco cam, Wittagram that I use to put the white borders on. In my social folder I've got Hello Mail which is a really useful voicemail services, Insta Follow where you can check how many followers you're on on Instagram and OK Hello. In my music folder I've got Shazam which I'm always using to find out the names of songs that I hear on the radio, ringtones and helium video. In my reference folder, I've got a dictionary, find my iPhone and PayPal. Next is the travel folder and this app, National Rail app, is so so good because you can check all your trains and all the times and the platforms and stuff. Finally is the game folder and oh my god, Farm Heroes. I love Candy Crush, but I'm pretty addicted to this game too. It's pretty much Candy Crush, except with vegetables. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. My phone pretty much still has the same kind of apps on it. Obviously, I've changed it around a bit. So, I hope it wasn't too samey to my other What's On My iPhone video. And I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, and I will see you soon, guys. Bye!